All right, guys, there's all bait fish jumping out right here. Oh my God, already got a fish, guys. Oh, it's a big brim. Fish on. Yes, beautiful. G'day, legends. Welcome to another episode. Today, we're in the Melbourne CBD. Really crappy conditions today. Very overcast, windy, and rainy. So we're just using light gear today. Soft plastic, seeing if we can get some brim, estuary perch, pinky, see what's around. And uh, yeah, let's see what we can get. It's pretty windy, so we'll go around Go around some edges, underneath some piers and stuff like that. Hopefully we can get some fish in these extreme conditions. Jesus, this is a nightmare getting through. And it's high tide, so hopefully we can even get under there in one of our spots. But um, I'm trying my best to get there, but I'm getting absolutely soaked. How's this for summer? Yeah, all right, Melbourne. Anyways and get past through all this crap. Let's see if we can get to the spot. Well, I've got good news and bad news. Good news is we're here. Bad news is, is we can't get under because the tide is too high. So we're just gonna try in here, wait until the tide starts going down. It's gonna take a while, but um, hopefully we can manage a fish somewhere. What if I try flicking it under? Alrighty, I got it under there. All right, guys, there's all bait fish jumping out right here. Something's chasing them and smashing them on the surface. I've just got my plastic in them. Oh, got something. Oh my God. Something really small. I think they're a little tail or salmon or something like that. I'll just turn the kayak around. This wind's very annoying. We'll see if we can get one. go back in there there's a drain right here wonder if I get a, a fish here it's good enough oh my god already got a fish guys oh it's a big brim <laughs> oh my god I just saw that smasher and it's actually a, oh, ah, it was a big brim, guys. It's wrapped around my tip. Bloody hell. Actually put a knot in my tip. There we go. I hope you guys saw that fish because it was pretty decent. It was around 40 centimetres. Literally as soon as it must have been just waiting in there. Now see all that rubbish from the rainwater, that's all coming out of the drains. And what that does, the benefits from it, is bait fish get attracted to that, feeding on the small sort of stuff that comes out from it, and the brim underneath and on the edges of that. So you'll mostly find, we'll pick up a fish in here or find a lot of small brim, which I can see some already just along the edge, and um, hopefully can pick up a fish. Just gonna try in this drain again, I'll quickly Hope just in front, just on an angle so I can cast in there or flick it in there. Oh yes, beautiful. Wow, it's actually really, really shallow in there. It's about 300 mil of water. That's why the brim, that big brim I lost, um, smashed as soon as it hit. Oh, there's a whole school of big brim, guys. Whole school of big brim. Massive school of big brim. Gotta be really quiet here. Ho! Oh, what do I have here? A little brim. Just smashed it quickly chuck this guy back because there's some big, big, uh, big brim in there. 
That's a little brim. Nice little guy, put him back. Off he goes. This drizzle is gonna affect the, the cameras. Under in here. Just flicking here. And let's see if we can get a uh, big brim. Oh, yeah, fish on. Fish on. Oh, yes. This is a better brim or better fish, can't see it just yet. Oh yeah, nice little brim. Come on, come in the net. Yes, beautiful. That's what we want, upsizing. Well, it's really, really drizzling out there now. And I've got a beautiful fish just on the uh, soft plastic there, two and a half inch grub. Happy with that. Look at that beautiful blue there on the fish, just in the corner of the lip. And we will let her go. you got to soak me. Anyways, let's see if we can get some more fish. Today, I'm just using a two to eight pound rod matched with a 2,500 reel, and that's running six pound braid and six pound fluorocarbon leader. Now I'm running a 1 16th jig head with a two and a half inch soft plastic. So this is a grub soft plastic. So I'm gonna show you guys how to use it and hopefully we can pick up some fish. Ready to go. Hit the bottom now. A few small twitches with a slow retrieve. Let it sink down. Twitching it up again. Let it sink down. Nothing on that cast. Oh yeah, oh. Yep, fish on. Got him on. Only a small one. But still fish. And just came off. Easy release. See if we can get a, uh, a bigger fish. They're all following the kayak. I'm not sure if you can see that. They're everywhere. Look at them all. We're in a bit of an awkward position here. Wiped it on the surface. Oh, I saw him. I saw him. He's there. He's very interested. You watch. I'll get him this time. Hopefully. Fingers crossed, guys. It's a decent brim. Just sinking down. All right. Are you ready, guys? I should get him. Yep, guys. Fish on. Come out here, buddy. I got that fish, that brim. Oh, he's going to go in the pylon. Don't go there, mate. Oh, yes. It's a good fish. Oh, look at that. Beautiful fish. Yes, I got him. Beautiful. That was the fish that I saw. Very nice, healthy brim. 
He absolutely choked that. Where's the plastic going? Right down there. That is another beautiful black broom. Look at that. What an awesome fish. You just engulf that plastic. Stoke with that. So that's about, I've got about three or four fish now, and that's the second solid brim. It's around, I'd, I'd say that's around 37 centimetres. So another nice, another nice fish. There you go. Beautiful. <laughs> and off he goes. He had a lot of energy still. See if we can get some more. Yes, it's finally low enough and the current is roaring. Look how fast I'm going. Bloody hell. Hopefully we can get under there. Jesus. that in here mind the ship parked here uh, it's a bit loud under here hopefully there's some EPs or some brim give it a crack and I'm moving 100 miles an hour oh oh had a hit already whoa hooked up to a big fish guys whoa. Hooked up to a really good fish. No, it's gonna go in the pole. It's current. It's no good. Whoa, what is this? Yes, I got it. Oh, it's a nice brim. It's a nice brim. quickly take this out because I'm moving 100 miles an hour but that is a whoa settle down buddy but that is a really really nice brim it's got a lot of energy I'm gonna take it pin this guy out and uh send her back off you go guys that unfortunately concludes the episode it was about an hour and a half worth of fishing unfortunately the battery is on five percent so just going to conclude the episode now we got a fair few brim first day back in 2021 in docklands on the kayak chasing some brim on ultralight spin gear using soft plastics we managed a couple of fish and a couple of nice fish too so overall wasn't too bad um, under these crappy conditions but anyway hope you guys enjoyed if you enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment your thoughts in the comments below subscribe if you're new please subscribe it helps a lot and i'll see you guys in the next one